All right, let's talk about Archimedes today, specifically the Archimedes Eureka moment, how insight actually happens. So we have these moments, these kinds of aha moments, and, and, and I want to talk through five ways that we can kind of nurture them and nudge them along, nudge ourselves along to the possibility of having more Eureka moments, those aha moments and solving problems when we're trying to make decisions, discover things, and so forth. So uh, Archimedes, um, a mathematician from the 200s BC, and a philosopher and the the idea of the Archimedes Eureka moment comes from this situation where the king has this crown that's been given to him and it's supposed to be solid gold but there's suspicion that it has been kind of adulterated with uh, silver and so the question is well how can you tell how do you discern this and Archimedes is trying to come up with a plan to figure this out and he, he discovers it not while just sitting there staring at the crown but he's taking a bath and as he takes a bath he notices that as he gets in the water that the water gets displaced it moves up because of the weight of his body going into the, into the bath and and that moment that experience triggers the solution to the problem that he could he could uh, submerge the the crown and you can determine the density of the crown based upon how much the water is displaced. Aha! He gets it, he goes and he helps figure out the problem. So that's why we call it the Archimedes Eureka moment. So do you want more of those in your life?